What's up, everybody? It's your favorite entertainment blogger, Andre J. Thomas, and I am backstage live at the A3C Country... A3C conference with your boy Kenfo, Kia Shine. How y'all doing out there, man? Memphis on. So tell us what brought you to A3C conference. Uh, first of all, um, it's always always a blessing to be able to see a lot around this the young energy because there's always somebody here, always somebody. The next person is on the way here. You know what I mean? So you're gonna catch somebody that either just got on or on the way. I'm performing uh, tonight in the over in Edgewood or what have you. But um, you know, it's just being able to. Uh, to be around and network to increase my network, man. You know what I mean? And that, that keeps me young and in the loop and what's going on with this music. You know what I'm saying? Now tell our listeners, what actually got you started into this industry? What got me started in music was uh, just a, a, a calling, man. I feel like it was a calling from God, man. I mean, you know, you, you're many are called, but few are chosen. Yes. I feel like the vision was the vision that he had for me. Mm-hmm. Um, there was something about music that, drawn, that drew me to it. Yes. Um, how I was going to be used in it, you know, I wasn't really sure, but I was able to just take those steps and um, you take two steps towards your purpose, man. Your purpose is to take two, five steps towards yes. you. Yes. So that's pretty much what I started to do. And the, and it's, it's kind of like he just navigated me to where I'm supposed to be and where I'm supposed to be at this season or that season. You know what I mean? So that's pretty much how I got started. Just really an internal search for wanting something more or believing for something more than what I was living at the time. So with you being an artist, what's the one thing that you wish someone had told you when you got in the industry? I wish someone would have told me that God will show you the vision but he won't show you the middle part. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He'll show you like your end result. Mm-hmm. And you get it hyped and you like, yeah, I'm ready to go at this. But it's like you get a, it's like you may have an idea, right? You may have an idea today. That may be a million dollar idea. Yes. But it may not be in season for that idea yes. until three years from now. Yes. But, you know, but sometimes you can be so hyped on the idea or the yes. feeling and you see it inside you so bad, but you just... You, you, you got to be patient. Yes. Somebody would have told me, man, just, yeah, you got it, but just be patient. You're right. Work, that was through, it, work through it, and then your, your time going to come in, that, in, in your season because everybody have a season. So that's something I would, someone would have told me because well, it stopped me from being worried, so much worried. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so then just some final thoughts. What encouraging words would you give someone who's kind of like you said, they're in the middle, and they just don't think it's going to happen? Well, I, I would say, man, first of all, be encouraged. You know what I'm saying? Through prayer, through, through, through prayer, like anything is possible. Because mm-hmm. I, 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 me, Music is it's such a spiritual favor thing, man. You know what I mean? So I just, for me, I know that it's, God, God said all promotions comes from him. Yes. So at the end of the day, you promote one, you put down another one. So if you're going through it, just know you got to go through it to get to it. Yes. Know that when you stop, you lose. Know that the game is not over until you win. Okay. It ain't over until you win. Okay. Everything that you're going through is a lesson until you get to your blessing. Okay. Period. And everybody sleeping on you, they're going to wake up working for you. So how can our listeners find you on social media? Uh, I have a new project that I'm working with, a new artist. Her name is Tomboy. We got a group thing together. So you can look me up at TomboyKenfolk.com. T-U-M-B-O-I-I-K-I-N-F-O-L-K.com. Now you guys heard it live from Kenfolk Kaya Shine. Don't go anywhere. We have more of my favorite broadcast, The Joe Lockett Show on Superstation 101.1 WYDE.